This is fascinating. And I'm a writer. I write books. Yeah. And I would never put that in a book because people are thinking, there's no way the, that could happen. Listen, the, the fact that you're saying that validates me because I literally am like, there's no way this happened. There's no way. But go ahead. It's, it's unbelievable what happened that day. I mean, SEALs were getting a lot of publicity. Navy SEALs jumped in, rescued two aid workers in Somalia. Big, big hit. Got Bin Laden. Big, big hit. You know, we're getting a lot of great successes. And then Captain Phillips is captured. Somali pirates come up to Captain Phillips. They take over his boat, and everything went wrong. They finally got some Somali pirates in this big orange covered raft, a lifeboat, and Captain Phillips in there, and they held him at gunpoint. Seals jumped in. They got up to the USS Bainbridge, I believe it was, and they climbed up the ship, and they said, you three snipers, just be at the deck of the ship to see what's going on. So they had the, the covered lifeboat here and the ship here. The lifeboat's going up and down. The ship's going up and down. They're trying to negotiate with the hostages to try to figure out some way. They've never trained for a mission like that. Yeah. Who in the world would think of training for that type of mission? They were thinking of taking the lifeboat, dropping off on shore, let the Army take care of it. Nothing was working. Secretly, they were pulling the lifeboat in a little closer little by little, without the pirates knowing about it. Finally, they said, shit, we, we don't know what to do right now. What are we going to do? They finally got the word to the SEAL snipers. And I've seen this lifeboat. It's in the SEAL uh, Museum at Fort Pierce, Florida. Oh, shit, okay. The windows are hard to look through. They're small, they're thick, and it's like opaque glass. It's hard to look through them. And I'm not a sniper, but I can't even imagine what, Three snipers trying to look through that glass with Somali pirates holding weapons up to hostages' heads. And then they're told, if you guys can get a shot, take it. Rob O'Neill and others I know were on the ship this day. And they heard one shot, which was actually three shots at the same time. <laughs> what? All going through the windows, all pirates dead, all hostages okay, Captain Phillips rescued. It's like fiction. We couldn't believe that happened. What? That is an unbelievable story. It doesn't sound real, but that's what happened that night. 